This is Andy Dunner 21, this is part 2 of my oil change. Now, as you can see, all the oil is drained from the engine. I uh, just need to crack this pump off. So with your, uh, with your, uh, see this is where it gets a bit tricky, with your uh, oil filter wrench. Grab hold of it and then twist it. <laughs> Should come off relatively easy. Just... And again, to get to a point where you can undo it with your hand. You should be able to undo it with your hand. There we go, see? And yes, again, there will be some oil comes out, this is where you need your bucket again to catch it. And I've made a foul mistake of not putting my glove back on, but right. should be able to pull the filter all the way off now. I'm gonna get oily one way or another, so might as well do it now. Yeah, a bit too oily. <laughs> Oh well, you get these things, you... shit happens, as they say. So just let that drip for another couple of minutes. And then, uh, I should be right to put that sump plug back in. So, now with the sump plug, put a new washer on it, clean the, the actual Things up myself and make sure you make sure you get it in right, screw it in first with your hands just to get it purchased and then tie it up until you get it just about nipped up in your hands. There we are, and then the rest of it with the wrench. It's not really good practice to get your tools covered in oil, but Oh, well. Tighten it up with the wrench. Don't go too tight with it though. Just enough. There we are. Maybe just a tad more. Make sure you go and get it right though. There we are. So that's done with that. And now what you need is rag. Uh, this is for part three. Which I will start in a minute. Alright, see you in a bit. 